I give to you a, a really hardworking uh, Oregon Senator, Senator Jeff Merkley. This journey is far from complete. We have to get this bill to the floor of the Senate, and we have to get this bill to conference committee, and the bill that comes out of conference committee has to honor the principles we've been fighting for. And some of those principles that Senator Whitehouse and Senator Booker and I were fighting for were that states could act if the federal government was failing to act, that states could co-enforce the law and benefit when they penalties are extracted so that we have we team up with boots on the ground at the federal level and the state level. The worst chemicals would be able to have a fast track and make sure they're considered. And that the, the lane for chemicals sponsored by the chemical industry and the lane for chemicals being considered in the public interest are tied together so you can't put a green light on one and a red light on the other. These are critically important changes that bipartisan support emerged for, uh, really crafted a, a, a solid foundation for making this work. Since 1991, the number of chemicals that we have regulated is zero. We know, as Chris mentioned, 700 new chemicals a year are being introduced, many other chemicals that have known toxic properties. Senator Derman mentioned the flame retardants. And when I was in the Oregon House, we attempted to regulate flame retardants. And what did we discover? We discovered that when we have our little babies, and I've enjoyed waving at your little girl here, that our babies are crawling on tarp carpets and are impregnated with flame retardants that are cancer-causing. That when they climb on the couch cushions, they both the fabric and the foam is laden with these cancer-causing chemicals. That when they put on their pajamas, their pajamas are full of cancer-causing chemicals. This is completely outrageous, and it's because Tosca has been broken. We must fix it. This is the window of opportunity. Let's get it done, and thank you so much.